A bow tie is a statement. Almost an act of defiance. Now, Rip Kaplan said that. Now, remember that by the end of this. I own a company um, that manufactures bow ties here locally in Phoenix. And you're wondering why, when a state tie is a bolo tie. Well, the idea came from my grandfather. When he passed away in 2008, he left me his neckties. Now, these were post-1970s neckties, really too wide. Really didn't know what to do with it. So they were just sitting in my uh, living room, just collecting dust. But I knew there was a way to do that. So I took the passion of architecture, depth of reuse, and I transformed it. And they had cool, kick-ass patterns. And guess what happened? I created a company that made bow ties. So let me just tell you a little bit about the history of bow ties. So back in the 1700s, <laughs> Croatian army, uh, Croatian, uh, army <laughs> actually were fighting, but they couldn't keep their shirts on. For some reason, when they fought, their shirts were coming off, so they had to create a bow tie or a cravat. So what happened next was, since the, <laughs> since the French saw this, they said, hey, you know what? We love it. We have to make a statement with this. And right after that, guess what happened? Spread all over the world. Bow ties here, bow ties there, everywhere. And now a bow tie is in our history. How? Well, you can tell by the people that wear them. We'll get to that point a little bit later. There are three types of bow ties. A thistle, a bat wing, and a butterfly. The thistle is a diamond shape, very jovial, very casual, as you can see. The bat wing is more of a tuxedo tie. And now these gentlemen that wear the bow ties, just remember that they always have three different things associated with them. Think Abraham Lincoln. He had his top hat, he had his beard, guess what? A bow tie, Groucho Marx. He had his mustache, his cigar, and a bow tie. Even looking at the generations of James Bonds, guess what you have? You've got a bow tie, you've got a Bond girl, and you've got a martini. Come on, right? Men, take notes on this. Just want to let you know. So, what does it have to do with Phoenix? Well, it's about making Phoenix community, building it up, giving a bit of progress. A lot of local heroes wear bow ties. Steve Nash, right? Pay no attention to the man bag over here, <laughs> all right? And Jim Atkins from Jimmy Eat World, all right? All cool people wear bow ties. So, it's all about the education, right? People are afraid. How do I do it? I don't know how to do it. Well, I'm here to tell you it's a lost art, but it's really, really simple. And I'll let you know that in 15 seconds or less, I can tie a bow tie. Eight simple steps. Now, I won't go over too detailed with it, but overall, this is all it takes. All right. Timing worked out perfect. So you can enjoy your bow tie with a burger. How about a beer and a bow tie? What about bikes and bow ties? Looking good on your beach cruiser, anything like that, with your buddies. You see the alliteration of the bees going on here? Overall, it's about having fun with it. And I'll tell you right now, I've been approached by more women than actual guys who are saying, hey, you know what? I'd wear a bow tie. Great. It's about empowerment. It's about breaking down barriers. That's exactly what a bow tie does. <laughs> Why not enjoy a bow tie with your sweetheart? Have fun with it. Enjoy it. Celebrate it. Do so in a way that it's going to be a lifelong memory. Now, I heard by 2030 that we're going to have driverless cars, but I think before that time, we're going to have talking bow ties. <laughs> Honestly, I think so. Wake up, hey, you look good. Awesome. <laughs> and who can resist a dog and a bow tie? I just pulls my heartstrings right now. I'm actually looking for business partners, so therefore, it, that's actually going to be a dog, so I'm looking for... Uh, so what I said before was, Rick Kaplan said, a bow tie is a statement, almost an act of defiance. I don't think so. I think a bow tie is community. I think a bow tie is empowerment, education. Thank you.